What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Thank you for being here. I really do appreciate it. Um, while you're at it, go ahead, hit that subscribe button because you don't want to miss any of these. So hit that subscribe button and then make sure you click on the bell. It's going to do a drop down menu. Make sure you click the one that says all. That way anytime I do a video, you get notified about it. And if you like the video, make sure either in the middle, at, at any point when you start liking the video, smash that thumbs up button. And I, I really do appreciate that. I, I love, I appreciate the love and support that you guys show. Okay, so I'm back out in the shop. It has been a while since I've been out here. Had some family issues going on. Uh, work issues, and when I say work issues, meaning like work got really hectic and crazy. I would come home super, super late from work. Uh, and know it is football season. So I've been working a lot of the uh, school football games. And by the time I get home, I'm just so tired that I don't even want to come out here to the shop. So that's why I haven't been doing a lot of my videos. Uh, probably one of the biggest reasons I'm so tired is because I run out of some of my supplements. I know you guys do that too. You get so tired that you don't want to do anything. But if you jump over to buckedup.com, buckedup.com, they have a humongous line of health products, supplements, and whatever else. So if you're looking to lose weight, they got you. If you're looking to put on muscle, they got you. If you're looking to just improve your overall health, whether it's sleep, uh, digestion, whatever, they got you. So either click on the link below or go to buckedup.com, use promo code 325 to save 20% off of your entire purchase. So jump on over and take care of that. Uh, today's video, uh, it's October. Uh, I, I have a really big decision to make since it is the month of October. Since last month here in, in my state, in Arkansas, we have already gotten into the archery deer season. Today actually starts muzzleloading season. So, big decisions to make. Knowing that most of the people are out in the woods, now would be a really good time to jump on the woods. I know a lot of people are thinking, man, that's crazy. It's cold out but think about this, uh, the nights are getting longer, the nights are getting colder, which means the water temperature is getting colder. So that means that the fish are starting to move out of that, that deep water where it's nice and cold down deep, and now they're moving up shallow where the water is also nice and cool, which means they're going to be feeding on a lot of the bait fish up shallow, which is a good thing. Because now that fall bite is here, and there ain't nothing better than catching fish on top water or in that that top to middle column of the water. And that's why I'm about to show you monster bass for the month of October. Get your monster bass bag. Uh, jump on over to monster bass, or you know what? Just click that link that's down there. You know, click that link. If you use the promo code SAVE10. You save $10 off your first month's uh, subscription. Monster Bass. Do I really need to explain Monster Bass? It's a subscription bag. I mean, you, you, you sign up for your subscription, and every month they send you a bag full of baits, and you go fishing. But there's more. With Monster Bass, they pick the baits tailored to your reach where you live. So you're not going to get a bag full of baits that might work in California or up in the Midwest if you live in the South. Just like if you're in California, you're not going to get a bunch of baits that's going to work for you down in Florida and stuff like that. You're going to get baits that is designed, uh, well, not really designed, but the color and action will be catered to your region that you live in and the, the, the uh, behaviors that the fish are going through. So that's what makes Monster Bass so much better than the others. Everything is picked based on your region and the weather conditions that you will be facing to 
help you catch more bass. So without further ado, let's jump into the October Monster Bass Bag for the Southern Region. Okay, so as always, you get a card. This one is introducing the Seeker Series crankbait from Monster Bass. This is a crankbait that Monster Bass itself has designed. Uh, right now, I'm looking at on the card here three sizes: Seeker Six, which dives down to six feet; Seeker Eight, which dives down to eight feet; and the Seeker Twelve, which dives down to twelve. So, a little bit of information for you. Uh, card here using a promo code. Go to six uh, Monster Bass. I'm sorry. Go to Monster Bass, and you can get the Excite XB crankbait. Uh, for free using that code, so that's cool. Monster Bass is always trying to hook people up. Let's go with the golden ticket. You get you a bag, you get this golden ticket. Uh, every Thursday, Rick, and sometimes he has a special guest, which is usually a, a pro bass angler, uh, do a podcast. And if he calls your number, you have to be watching them. You have to be watching the uh, Monster Bass Live on YouTube. But if they call your number, you win a prize. So get you a Monster Bass bag because, for one, you're already getting great baits. Where if you were to go to your local tackle shop or any other website, uh, tackle warehouse, and order all of these baits, you're going to pay close to $50 at least. With this, you're getting those same baits for about $30. So that's $20 that can either go into your gas tank, uh, the tank on your boat, $20 to help pay for your license to go fishing. So think about that. Saving money or you're able to use that money somewhere else. So that's always a good thing. Saving money is always good. Okay, y'all. Let's jump into the nitty gritty. You have your monster bass. Information card is what I'm going to start calling it. It's your information card. On the front, it is featuring Alex Rudd. He is one of the Monster Bass uh, staff members. Uh, check him out at Alex Rudd on YouTube. Uh, Alex Rudd Fishing. Instagram at Alex Rudd Fishing. And I don't know what this other little... Somebody help me. What does that icon mean? What social media platform is that icon? Let me know, please. But check out my man, Alex Rudd. He's always got some good information, good content. And a really good dude. So let's jump into it. First up on the list is, well, I already got mine. It is my Excite Baits XB5 crankbait. Here's another thing that Rick and the people at Monster Bass do. Inside this little card, which I'm going to read all of this stuff to you, but if you get your own bag, it already has uh, descriptions and details of how to work these baits. So it's not like they're sending you a bag of baits and then it's like, okay, we did our part by sending this stuff to you. Now, you figure out how to use it. No. Rick and the people at Monster Bass, they're not about that. They want to help you catch more fish. So what better way other than getting you great baits at a really good price, but then giving you the information for you to go out and actually use that bait correctly and catch more fish. So here we have the, uh, like I said, it's the Excite XB5 crankbait. Uh, this one dives down two to five feet. Uh, it's the shad color. Threadfin shad, oh, I'm sorry. Threadfin shad, for some reason, when I see that pattern right there, most of your other little companies, they always name that sexy shad, but this one is their Threadfin shad. Okay, this bait comes in at $9, and what Rick does is most of these baits, he pulls their prices off of Tackle Warehouse. So he's comparing the Tackle Warehouse price, once you add all this stuff up, to the amount you're paying for your subscription to lose. So that way you can see how much you're saving. Okay, so the XB5 crankbait has a distinct rattle. Uh, if you if you actually take this out of the package, which I'm not going to do because I don't have any of my, my Tackle here with me, it's in my boat. And I don't want to try to take this stuff out and then having to try to put it back into the packages so I don't get hooks in my hand. But if you hold 
the hooks and hold the crankbait in your hand. What? I can hear a rattle. It has a distinct rattle to attract even the most finicky fish. So that rattle really, really attracts them. Uh, it's built in buoyancy to reduce hangups. So it's very buoyant. So if you're not cranking this, it will start to float up. So that way you're not sitting down there and it's getting hung up. And wide belly designed to push water and produce strong vibration. So the way it's designed with that, that belly, I don't know if you guys can see that with the camera angle. It's very wide, so it has a very good wobble to it to help push water. And the reason you want that is because on a bass, there is a lateral line here. I'll try to show you. you. Look at this picture here of this guy. I don't know if you guys can see. There's a line going across that bass. They use that line to feel the vibration in the water. So that wobble that this crankbait will make will cause a lot of vibration in the water, which will help the fish hone in on where that's coming from. So that way you can get, uh, they can detect the bait fish so they eat, which will then help you put more fish in the boat. That makes sense to you. So that comes in at $9. Next, we have the Okay, this is the uh, Pastaic Baits CXB Lipless Crankbait. It comes in at $8. Unfortunately, when my bag was being put together, I didn't get the Lipless Crankbait. So if anybody at Monster Bass is watching this, I'm not bashing you guys at all. I'm pretty sure y'all were busy. Just letting you know, I didn't get my Lipless Crankbait, but hey, you don't see any tears from me. Not even worried about it. Uh, I'll try to find a picture of it and put that picture here to show it right here in front of my face. Uh, it has a dual line tie configuration for different running depths. So I actually saw somebody else do a review on their channel. On the top of the lipless crankbait, it has two different line ties. Uh, fast sinking and sits chin down when stationary. So you think about it, it sinks really fast. So when it gets in the water, it goes. But then it sits chin down, so like this, whenever it's stationary. And they suggest you fish on a straight retrieve or yo-yo action. Straight retrieve, you throw it out there, and then you're just winding it back in. The yo-yo action, you throw it out there, you let it sink, and then pop it up. And then as it's going back down, you, you reel up your slack and you're just doing that. So just imagine how you would do a yo-yo. Dropping it down and bring it back up, same thing. Next, we just talked about it. It is the Monster Bass Seeker Series Crankbait. Uh, this one that I have is the Seeker 6. It dives down four to six feet. It is two and a half inches in length and an ounce and a half, or half ounce, excuse me, half ounce in weight. Uh, like all monster bass crankbaits or lures with treble hooks, has the uh, signature red hook to uh, imitate uh, a wounded or bleeding bait fish. This color is what they call the baby blues. Let's see here, round bill for uniquely erratic hunting action. So the bill is the crankbait lip, a magnetic weight transfer system for long accurate casting. So inside of this has a magnetic weight system. So when you throw it, that weight will shoot to the back of the lure and help it get out there. And razor shock katana hook. So there's the hook that we were talking about. This lure, ten dollars right here. So that's that's gonna be a good one. Lucky strike. So here's what happened. Uh, I told y'all I didn't get the lipless. I end up getting two of these Lucky Strike crankbaits. It's the exact same thing, but you know I always say two is better than one anyway. So uh, the Lucky Strike. I need both of them. Shallow smoothie. Uh, this color shallow smoothie brim so I can see that it's painted in a brown color because right now fish are feeding on bait fish, shad, brim, bluegill, stuff like that. 
uh, made in the USA. Aqua 3D finish with reflective glitter for extreme uh, attraction. Armor gloss gel coat for impact and fade resistance. So this thing you can bang this on trees, docks, and everything. It's not gonna crack because they have a, a gloss gel coat over it to protect it. This lure comes in at six dollars. Now, okay. Now Rick always tries to pull up local bait companies. One, he looks for bait companies that are made in the USA. So that's always a jump. That's a thumbs up. In fact, you should smash that thumbs up right now. That's what it is. But on the spot bait, we have the finesse hog, which is if you've ever fished with the brush hog, this is pretty much like uh, it's the baby brush hog. Uh, on the spot. In fact, it's a three-inch baby brush hog. Dingleberry is the color that they call it, and it's a pack of eight. Trying to see, it just says custom board in the USA. I'm trying to see where if it's mentioned in the paper. So, hand poured in the USA, appendages produce subtle, natural, lifelike action. I don't think there's any appendages that are attached, but if there is, make sure you pull the appendages apart uh, so that way they have a, a kicking action that helps put off vibration, displace water and it helps to attract the fish and it's designed to be fished in tough high pressure conditions so when it's time for you to switch over to your finesse tactics pull this out and give this a try these come in at four dollars a pack so that's pretty good you got eight in here and only four dollars man you can't beat that next up we have the big bite baits coon tail There it is. Yes, there you go. So, this one comes in at $4.50. Big Bite Baits Coontail. This is the color June Bug. I have a pack of seven. And this is the 4.75. So, Texas Rig, Weightless Texas Rig, Carolina Rig, Shaky Head, you know, any of those. Can, you, can be used for particularly practically sorry can be used for practically any technique like I just said I know I missed a few of them that might have been mentioned but I'm sorry but it can be used for practically any kind of technique uh, bulk tail and non-linear center core for increased action so in the middle it this bait isn't designed with just a straight design in the middle here it has a contour which helps with uh, water displacement which is going to give it a lot of action in the water and protruding ribs wave and breathe in the slightest current so again uh, the body has these ribs on it so that way when it's going through the water it's going to produce a lot of vibration which is going to attract the fish and produce a lot of strength for it uh, yes, I did tell you the price on that. Now, oh, this is hiding from me earlier. One more little bit. Monster bass sticker. You know what? While you guys are watching. I know what y'all are going to say. If y'all have seen my other videos, you're going to say, why are you putting a fish sticker on the gun side of your shop? Because I can't. My shop. Show my support all over. So we go. Yeah. That's what I was doing. My favorite, my favorite, my favorite. You pick up a package of these. That man is on it. It's almost guaranteed. You can't go wrong with Strike King Ned Ocho. If you've ever fished with the Strike King Ocho, which is their stick bait. Well, the Ned Ocho is just the same thing. It's just they chop it down. Uh, this one is the Black Blue Swirl. Pack of nine. Two and three quarter. Ray, I, I'm sorry, I'm reading the wrong thing. Strike King Ned Ocho notch channel channels release bubbles when pulled through the water. Stands up when dragged across the bottom on a jig head. Exclusive coffee scent technology to mask human scent. This comes in at $6. So if 
you've ever uh, fished with Sprite King product, you know that they use a coffee stick to mask the human smell when you're touching the baits. So I think that also attracts them, you know, the fish. When they bite it, it just does something to where they don't want to let it go. But these are really good. Put these on your favorite uh, Ned heads and you can't go wrong with that. Speaking of Ned Head, Monster Bass are always doing something new. So here we go coming to you from their line of terminal tackle. You can't have two pack of Ned baits without some Ned Heads. Monster Bass Ned EWG. Razor Shop One Art Japanese Saber Tooth Hook. Uh, easy weedless rigging with a variety of Ned Rig, Ned Rig soft plastic designed to keep baits securely in place. So, uh, I get it. I get it. This size here. is one eighth ounce there you go one eighth ounce that didn't help that one eighth ounce ned ewg so and they painted this one it's black and blue so jigging it is painted black but then it's got some blue flake in it and that I mean, that combination right there will still pair up good with any bait that you use, any color. So, for one, that color paired up with these is going to be awesome. But that'll still work great on these. And I'm pretty sure it'll work on these. So, there you go. And as always, the Monster Bash reusable bag. You can either write the month, so you never forget what month this was, or you can start stocking up all of your favorite plastics into these bags. They're reusable. Do what you want with them. But hey, if you sign up and get you a subscription, you're going to pay about $30 for all of that. If you went to Tap a Warehouse and bought one bag and then bought all of that stuff, you're going to be paying for $50. So why not click on that link below and Sign up for a subscription that will cost you thirty dollars. But then, if you use the code Save Ten, you save ten dollars off of your first subscription. So now that first subscription is only going to cost you about twenty dollars. So come on, get some good baits. Scratch that. Get you some great baits at a great price and save money at the same time. So come on now, why not? Thank you for watching. As always, thank you for subscribing. Make sure you guys hit that like button and uh, let's get out there and catch some fish. Also be looking out for my uh, Instagram and Facebook of me trying to get out here in the woods and stick a deer, because it's that time. Again, like I said, you're either fishing or hunting. Sometimes you might be able to do both, but uh, Leave me some comments. Let me know what you're doing. Let me know how it's going. And uh, see you guys back here on the next one.